and we have visitors from the diaspora. They are looking amazing, right? They are yeah. looking good. And so before we start, I would like to invite Nikki, Nikki to come and at least take us through, tell us more about them, what they're here to do and everything. Nikki, welcome. How are you? As Asante ni sana, asante ni sana kukuja. So, um... Tashkili, acha nikushkilia tu. Oh, nikushkilia, right? Yeah, yeah. So, um, thank you so much, um, this is a very special day for us uh, that we have brought guests into the country, right? And just for me not to miss anything, I will, I will read a note that I prepared here, then we'll go into your Q&A, okay? Thank you. Um, my name is Nico Gutu. I'm the founder of Safari Yango. I want to take this chance to welcome all our guests to the beautiful land of Kenya, the motherland, Africa, Karibu Nisama, you are all welcome. <laughs> to all the Kenyans and non-Kenyans who are here at the airport or are watching online, I know you may be wondering, what is this group and why are they here in Kenya? We are Safari Yangu USA. And our mission is very simple, very simple, to connect Africa and the global community of the black diaspora. These beautiful faces you're seeing here is a representation of that movement we are talking about. There's USA, Jamaica, Trinidad, Tobago, Haiti, no, Trinidad and Tobago, Haiti, Nigeria, Barbados, and many others. We believe 
there's enough of us around the world to trade with each other and benefit from our different capacities. In the US alone, the African-American market is worth trillions of dollars. So Safari Yangu is taking those baby steps in connecting our people. So we are here to learn, to learn our history, make connections, and spread the love, and just have fun for the time we are going to be here. Right? So from here, we are going to the Bomas of Kenya. We have a show, and you can come with us after this. So um, in the group here, we have got um, members of Safari Yangu. We have got guests who have joined us in the trip, and many more are coming after two weeks. So because I'm the host, I come from Kenya, Nikunyumbani, and I'm very happy. I want to give our guests, because of time, any of the guests, just a minute or less to say something, just to express their excitement, their perception of the country. I know they've just arrived right now, but at least they're forming, uh, they're forming memories already. Mm -hmm. They're forming perceptions. And they're seeing your happy faces already, right? Yeah. Sindhya? Yeah. And we have the Maasai people with us. Mm -hmm. We cherish our culture. We love our culture. Do you want to say something? To say something. Yeah. Okay. Hi. Hi. How Kindly are you? introduce yourself, then say something. I'm Rose Baru. Mm -hmm. I'm from New York, and this is my first time mm -hmm. to Kenya, mm -hmm. and I'm happy to be here. Mm -hmm. I heard a lot about your country, mm -hmm. and we know what people are loving, mm -hmm. so I'm happy to be here to share the love. Mm -hmm. What are your expectations here in Kenya? Well, we have a lot of activities, I understand, that mm -hmm. are waiting us. Mm -hmm. So I'm looking forward for that. Mm -hmm. that. What is that one thing you love to like to get from Kenya? Yeah, purposely when you came, you had something in mind that, well, I would like to have this or to see something in Kenya. Well, we're going to go to the show. Mm -hmm. So I want to see what the show is all about. Wow, wow, wow. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so. thank you so much. Can we get someone else, please, to say something? Yeah. Hello. Hello. Hi. Hi. I'm so. Uh, I'll let you hold yeah, it. Hold I'm it so you. happy to be here. My name is Omalara Ifu Funke, but my government name in America is Darlene. I have been to a number of African countries, but this is the first time in Kenya. Wow. I am elated. We are passionate. I'm sorry I don't have on my African garb. I have it in the suitcase, <laughs> but we are our attire. But we are so elated to unite the African diaspora, which is huge, and with the motherland. Because without the motherland, we are weak. We need you, you need us, we need each other, we love you, and thank you so much, Asante Sana, for that warm, warm welcome. We appreciate you, we are humble. Wow. Welcome, welcome. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> Hello, my name is Margaret. I'm originally from Barbados, so I live in New York. I'm just happy to be here. Um, I've never been to Canada before, but I went, I went to, um, to Ethiopia mm -hmm. and the pyramids. Mm -hmm. And even from the flight, the people were very, very friendly. And I just look forward to friendliness and the kindness in, 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 mm -hmm. in Kenya, meeting lots of people, eating lots of good food. Mm -hmm. Thank you. How does it feel being in Kenya for the first time? Um, just a little, a little happy, excited, just mm -hmm. waiting to see what's going to happen. Okay. Just taking all the, all the wonders. Mm -hmm. I, I, learned, I did Kenya and Barbados in school, mm -hmm. the history, and I'm just waiting to see what I can see, mm -hmm. all, all I can learn. Okay. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Nick? Can you? Yeah, Michelle. Uh -huh. Hi, Michelle. Hi, how are you? I'm Michelle Zatoni. I am from Pennsylvania. Mm -hmm. I've actually known Nixon for the last like eight years when he first started his project. So I am a little bit emotional about seeing this come to light because I saw him from the beginning when he had this mission. So to see everybody here mm -hmm. and to, to see you people welcoming him, it's, um, mm -hmm. it's, it's just amazing. Okay. So I'm very excited. Uh, here in Kenya, you say Karibu Sana. Karibu Sana. Uh -huh. that is, it means welcome. <laughs> <laughs> Karibu Sana. Uh -huh. right. Thank you. Oh, okay. Yes. So for me, I'm home, Mini Konyumbani. Yeah. I'm just waiting to get some nyama choma yeah. and <laughs> some kachumbari. These are different types of food. Okay. Yeah. Right? I'm waiting too. Yes, and uh, uh, you know, just enjoy home in general. Mm -hmm. um, 
Our visit is seven days. Uh, we are going to be here in Nairobi today and tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Then we leave for Mombasa. Mm -hmm. We are going to visit different places in Mombasa, mm -hmm. like the uh, Fort Jesus. We are going to go to Gedi Ruins. We will visit Wasini, Mombasa Old Town. And we are also going to have some fun there in Mombasa. Mm -hmm. You know, it's not just history. History is very important, mm -hmm. but it's also important that we, we do have fun, right? Mm -hmm. We work so hard where we come from. Mm -hmm. So when we travel, we want to have fun too, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, so we yeah. are going to enjoy. And you're already enjoying with our traditional dances yeah. here, yeah. you know? And we are, going to have, we are going to have more dances as we move along, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, so... Okay, before we wind up, let's get a question. SPM, do you have a question? Uh, just, just say maybe, uh, welcome. We are already in other countries, right? This is our second trip to Kenya. In June, we are going to Ghana, and then we are going to Senegal. We are going to Ethiopia. I can mention so many other countries that we already have an affiliation with, and it is not just only in the U.S. and Africa. We are going to Brazil. We were just in Canada in July, right? We'll be going to Jamaica. So the black people are all over the world. Tell me which country you'll go and you'll not find black people there. It is our mission as Safari Yangu to look for our people where they are and bring them together. We, we need to trade with each other. We need to uh, love each other. And we need to know our history. And Africa is motherland. Whether black people live in India, they live in Saudi Arabia, or even the smallest island in Europe, we will bring them to motherland. And this, uh, this is just the baby steps that we are doing, but we are going to continue doing this work. Yeah, so in the US, we work with both uh, uh, um, black immigrants and the African-American community. You know what happened 400 years ago when our people were taken from motherland here and taken to the islands and, and America. Okay, so we have to connect back uh, our people. Mm -hmm. So the second question is that are you planning maybe to work with the Minister of Foreign Affairs, maybe get a chance to meet the President? Yes, so we, we have those plans. It's only that the President is traveling to New York while we're here. Mm -hmm. Right, so we are not able to do that. And you know, today is an Independence Day. So all the government officials are at home and with their families. That's why we are not able to do that. But we are in consultation, they know that and they're aware of our presence here and they're very supportive and I'm so excited about that. We're just going to deepen that relationship to make it bigger, better and more beneficial for our people, not just here but around the world. Yes. Maybe a final word to people who are watching you right now, yes. what can you tell them? So what I'm saying, if you see a van, a tourist van with Safari Yangu logo on it, you know I'm in it, and we have got beautiful faces in it. Mm -hmm. you, you can stop us and say hi, because these people need to feel the love, okay? They need to know that we love each other, right? Yeah. Wakenya, Mutani Aibisha. Yes, you're not going to embarrass me with guests, right? <laughs> so, <laughs> so we'll be going to so many different places. We'll be going downtown to see, you know, the, the nightlife, the downtown life. We'll be going to the museum, Bomas of Kenya. So as I told you, it's all learning, connecting and having fun. You know, we are an easy people. Mm -hmm. We are not uptight here. We work so hard back where we come from. When we come here, we just want to have it easy and fun. Mm -hmm. Yes. Oh, thank you so much, Nick. We wish you all the best. And our guest, Karibuni Sana. You say, Asante. You say, Asante. You say, Wambir. Asante. Karibuni Sana. Yes. Asante is thank you. Thank you. When I say yeah. Karibu, it means uh, welcome. Oh. Then you say, Asante, it means thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Yes. Karibuni Sana. Asante. Thank you so much. Yes. Okay. Let's go.